morning guys it is currently eight o'clock in the morning I just woke up and made my bed and I had to take the sheets off my bed and throw them in the wash because smudge decided to leave me a present right next to me on my bed so that was pleasant to wake up to my forehead is currently breaking out what's new you guys know the drill but it's like a little bit worse than normal because I've been traveling and I've been stressed so today I just wanted to do like a spend the morning with me routine. Not even routine, but just like a spend the morning with me video because I've been doing a lot of like get ready with me type videos. And this is going to be similar, but I'm also going to show you like what I'm eating for breakfast and then and what other shenanigans I'm up to. So I guess we'll just start with makeup and I will see you guys over at the vanity. Okay, so I don't know exactly where the camera is or where I should be looking on this. So if I'm not looking directly at the camera during this, I apologize. I know it's probably really annoying. But I'm going to be looking at my face down here anyways quite a bit because I'm going to be doing my makeup. So, to kick it off, I have these little like surfboard clips that I got from my hairdresser. And she let me keep them. And I think they look really cute and professional when I'm doing my makeup. Like, look how cute that is. Eh? Yeah. Okay, so the first thing that I'm gonna do, I already have, like I already prepped my skin and like put some like lip gloss on, so I'm good to go. So I'm just gonna dive right in to, I don't know what that was. I'm just gonna jump right in with foundation. I'm just gonna run some errands today, so I'm not gonna do any, any makeup that's like super duper sick. <sighs> super duper spectacular but i'm gonna try to make it pop a little bit because i have some outfits in the other room i'm gonna do like a little try on haul because i got a bunch of outfits from shein and i'm gonna choose one of them to wear today and i'm gonna tell you guys a secret i actually tried them on last night so all the footage that you're gonna see is from last night but uh, just act surprised or i'll act surprised for you so First things first is foundation. And I actually am a little bit darker than my face. Like my body's a little bit darker than my face right now because I did I did like a really like quick self tanner yesterday, but not anything that's gonna make me like super dark. This is me trying to decide what shade to be. I guess I'll just do this one. This is kind of like my middle of the road one. This is the water foundation from Heart. The shake well, so I'm gonna shake it and I'm gonna put it on the back of my hand and that might be too dark. Uh, mm, yeah, I actually, hmm, I'm gonna put some tinted moisturizer in it and this one's in the shade Ivory from First Aid Beauty. So I'm gonna mix in the tinted moisturizer and it's gonna be fabulous. Oh, that's nice because it's not too like heavy. Oh, I like that. Also guys, I broke out of my neck, which has never happened before. Um, I think it's from like being on planes and stuff, but it's just weird. Like I've never had that before. Let me know if you've ever broken out on your neck. We can bond over it. I actually really like the way this looks. Like I feel like it looks nice and like dewy, but also like has enough coverage to where I'm not like insecure. Okay, so obviously you can still see like some of my spots, but I can just conceal those so i feel like we're doing pretty good now i'm gonna take my concealer and i am gonna use the shape tape concealer just because these spots on my face are like really difficult to cover oh and i'm gonna conceal a little bit under my eyes and then we're gonna roll with it okay so now i'm gonna set it but i'm not gonna set it too much because i still want it to be like on the more dewy side but I also don't want it to crease like crazy throughout the day. So I'm just gonna take a little bit of that and just go under my eyes and on my forehead where I concealed some of those like spots. Okay, well, these spots are never gonna fully be covered. So we're just gonna have to live with it. It's annoying. Now I'm going to move on to my eyebrows, which are pretty much done. I just need to like, darken them a little bit. I use the Jawbreaker palette by Jeffree Star for my eyebrows because there's a shade in it called Tasty. It's this one right here. And it's just a really good shade for like my eyebrows. There's a hair on it, gross. Like I just fill it in with this and it's like good. And the trick is not to fill it in too close to like the front 
because you want it to like fade a little bit. Or maybe you don't. If you don't want it to fade a little bit, more power to ya. You know what? I don't want perfect brows today. I just want, I just want them to exist. And that's how we live in. Now I'm gonna add like a, like a brow gel. I'm just gonna do this really lightly. Is one of my eyebrows darker than the other? Hold on. Yeah, I'm definitely overanalyzing things and it looks fine. Stop it. So, next I'm gonna use this MAC. I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be a highlight. I don't know, it's skin finish, whatever that means. But I'm gonna use this as bronzer and also as like a transition eyeshadow. So I'm gonna use a brush like this and I'm just going to put that in the crease. I'm not gonna be doing too much eyeshadow because the focus of this look today is gonna be on the wing, the winged eyeliner, so. Okay, so while we have the bronzer out, I'm gonna start bronzing my face and then I'll move into, I bounce around a lot in my makeup routine and I just kinda do whatever I'm feeling. And right now I'm feeling like I wanna bronze my face. I have so many errands to run today and it just hit me like how much stuff I have to do today. Mm. Do I want to do blush or do I want to do eyeliner? Okay, I'm going to do eyeliner and get it out of the way because that's like the trickiest part. Here's my eyeliner. I don't know why I'm like super weird right now. <laughs> like that's just in like a weird mood. Ooh, okay. I think this eyeliner is like running out. I'm gonna do the other side off camera because I'm going to freak out. I will be back, thank you. So I finished my eyeliner and now I'm gonna show you my new little trick that I've been doing just to change up my eyeliner a little bit. So I just take like a black eyeshadow and I just kind of smoke out the eyeliner that I've already done. If you have like trouble making your eyeliner even, this helps a lot. This is with it and this is without it i'm probably the only person who notices honestly but like i don't know i just like the way it looks and now i'm going to do my mascara and put on some lashes and i will be right back oh i'm gonna do a transition wait you know what actually i'm just not gonna do a transition because it's gonna look bad so i'll be right back okay so eye makeup is complete and i didn't do anything special i just added lashes and did my bottom mess Kira, um, now I'm gonna do blush. I'm gonna use this blush right here. I'm putting quite a bit of it on. And I also put it on my nose, but like not a lot on my nose, just a little bit on my nose like that. And then I'm gonna do my highlight here. So just highlighting. And then I'm gonna highlight my nose. And I'm also gonna use this on my inner corner. Ooh, and under my brow. <laughs> so I'm gonna try these Tarte. They look like lipsticks, but I'm pretty sure they're sheer. Kinda like it. I'm gonna put a gloss on top of it. Fenty gloss. Yeah, I'd say that looks pretty good. So then I was finished with my makeup and it was time to move on to the outfit. Like I said before, all of these clothes are from Shein. So I'm doing a try on haul. Our first top is this little butterfly sweater top and I love it because it matched my nails perfectly. It ties at the shoulders and it's super cute and really, really, really comfortable and soft. So from now until December 2nd, Shein is holding their annual Black Friday sale so you can get all of the items that I'm wearing and of course other ones on the site for up to 90% off, which is insane. Um, just like the shirt I'm wearing now, which is super cute, black and fuzzy. And also this shirt, which was one of my favorites because it just did something for my body that I have never had before. And it says honey on the front, really cute and also a really cute color. Um, you'll notice with this shirt, this is like a sweater type top. It's not really a sweater, but it's like a cardigan, I don't even know, like a button up. Um, but I actually got this in two different colors and a lot of their shirts and their basics come in a lot of different colors. So you'll see I got this one in gray and also in white. 
So if you don't like a color, there's usually another option, uh, which is really cool. Shein offers free returns within the first 40 days of ordering and free shipping on all orders over $49. And they add 500 new styles to their website every day. So you can stock up on trendy pieces like this, which is very um, specific. It's got a lot of detailing and... You know, you could wear this for like a little special occasion. I really love this. Um, but you can also get basics like the white shirt I'm wearing underneath. So again, I just wanted to say thank you to Shein for sponsoring this video. And all of the products that I have right here that I'm trying on for you guys will be in the description down below. Also, I want to apologize quickly for the fact that I'm wearing a black bra. I wanted a strapless bra so you guys can see the cut of the shirts. Um, but you can see right through, so I hope you can look past it. This dress, I wasn't expecting to like as much as I did, but it's so cute and so flattering. And I don't know, I just love it. As well as this coat. This coat surprised me so much. It's so flattering and such a nice color. This is definitely my favorite piece that I got. Um, it's just so cute. And I mean, I could wear this with like thigh high boots or like ankle boots and it, it's just so cute. So this next top is a really good example of the basics that they have. Uh, this is just a basic black crop top, but it's really fitting. Um, it fits really well, it's comfortable, and it's really cute. And I paired it with these pink pants that are also from Shein. Um, and they have a little belt that like buckles in the front and they're super comfortable and I love this outfit. So if you do head over to Shein um, to do some shopping, you can use my code MYLAUREN for 15% off the entire Shein site. The last thing that I got is this little sweater and it's got these little skulls on it and I'm probably gonna crop it, but it's so cute and I love the graphic so much so I had to get it. So now I'm going to move into hair and I think for sake of lighting, I'm going to stay in here. But typically I would do my hair in my bathroom, but the lighting is no bueno. Okay, so I'm back. I have my curling wand and my brush and I'm just going to curl my hair. Really simple. I actually hope it curls because I straightened it yesterday. Also, I got these like caramel caramel pieces added into my hair and I really like the way it looks. It's not my actual hair, it's just extensions that were added that are caramel, but I really like it. <coughs> I curl my hair starting from the back and I just section it off and put the pieces to the back as I go. It's really self-explanatory, really easy, and I just alternate the direction that I curl them in. So I'll curl this one over and then the next one I'll curl under and then I'll just keep doing that until I reach the front. I don't leave it on too long. I'm gonna leave it on a little bit longer just because my hair was straight before. So I wanna make sure that it actually curls, but I usually just leave it on until my hair feels hot. And the trick is to hold the curl together like this before you let it go. So I just kind of like crunch it up like that and I just kind of hold it like that for a second and let it cool. And when it feels like it's cooling down a little bit, then I let it go and there you have it. And then I just brush it out with my hand. And I just do that with my whole head. So the next curl I do will be, I don't know. I don't, it doesn't matter too much, but if you curl them all in the same direction, then all your curls will kind of become one big curl. So you kind of want to alternate so that they don't kind of group together and become one big curl. Um, I'm just gonna lapse this because there's really nothing spectacular about it. So, nothing special, just gonna lapse it. Okay, so now I am going to put in my earrings, which I keep right here because I wear the same earrings basically every day. And that's pretty much all there is to that. So now I'm gonna go ahead and put on the outfit that I picked from Shein and I will see you guys for a full 
reveal of the look. That was really ugly. Um, I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna go get changed. Okay, so this is the final outfit that I decided to go with. It's the black shirt with the pink pants that have this little belt. I decided to wear the black shirt because the belt is black, and I don't know. It's just really cute and cash, and I love it. And it's really comfortable actually. Like the pants have a lot of give, so I feel like I could do a lot of activities. So I'm gonna go downstairs now that I'm fully ready, make some breakfast, and I will see you guys in the kitchen. So update, I had to switch shirts because it's freaking hot in my house, but this one's also from Shein, so nothing new. So I think today for breakfast, I'm just gonna have like a bowl of yogurt with like fruit and granola and some honey. So I'll show you guys how I make that. And then I'm gonna get on with my errands. So let's go ahead and get into it. Also guys, I got like my homeschool diploma that my mom ordered in the mail. It's the funniest thing. Guys, there's literally no signatures on it. Like, <laughs> it's just a diploma. So I have all of my ingredients. I have vanilla yogurt because I don't like plain yogurt or Greek yogurt. So I have to have vanilla. So I have my yogurt. I just wash the raspberries. Always wash your fruit, kids. Um, honey and granola and I'm just gonna put all of this into the bowl and I'll show you what it looks like okay so this is my breakfast bada bing bada boom and I think that pretty much wraps up this video so thank you guys for joining me for my morning um, let me know what you guys want to see next in the comments and I'm going to go enjoy this and watch The Office. And I will see you guys next time. Bye. I love you. Mwah.